Morning Prayer for Tuesday, November 7th, 2023. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Beloved Lord, the sun's rays gently filter through my window and I recognize that it is you granting me a new and wonderful day. Through this prayer, I humbly come into your presence to offer infinite gratitude for the gift of life and the blessings that fill my days. Every detail that surrounds me resonates with the immense love you have for me. As this morning unfolds on the horizon, I place my trust in your hands, for you are the way, the truth, and the life. I believe in your boundless mercy that pours into my life day by day. Today, I raise my eyes to the sky, proclaiming your power, and from the depths of my heart, I want to tell you that I love you, my blessed and praised Lord. I wish to glorify your name, knowing that your presence will be by my side throughout the day, giving me the strength to persevere through any tribulations. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for allowing me to call myself your child, for recognizing that you are my God, my only Lord. I feel fortunate to believe in you and your power, and I humbly ask you, my beloved God, to make this day fruitful in all the activities I undertake, be it at home, work, studies, or any place I may visit. I beseech you to pour your grace upon me, enabling me to achieve my objectives successfully. Marvelous God, it is my desire to walk through this day under your light, your shelter, and your protection. Please prevent any harm from befalling me, shield me from accidents and misfortunes, and extend this protection to my family. You are well aware of my reality, my Lord. You know my weaknesses, my anxieties, and my sorrows. You are well aware of my imperfections and sins. Thus, I approach you today to request your transformation within me, to make me better and to align my path with your will. Incomparable Lord, I am unworthy of you, but I know that your love and mercy are greater than any imperfection. There are times when I become discouraged and consider giving up, but I implore you not to allow it. Please be the one to sustain me, for you are the only one capable of making all things possible. You can correct my path, help me believe in your love, and take my life, my God, and assist me in becoming a better person. May my family, friends, and all those around me see your light shining through my life. I want to be a testimony to you, my beloved Lord, to demonstrate the power of your presence and to know that nothing can defeat me when you are with me. It is a beautiful feeling to keep my hope in you, for you never fail us and never abandon you, S. I know you take all my concerns, burdens, problems, and needs, and I place them in your hands as you already know them. Help me, my God, and do not leave me alone in this battle, for if I am with you, if I am by your side, nothing can be lacking. I pray for this in the name of Jesus. Amen. Today's verse, Proverbs 16, verse 20. Whoever gives thought to the word will discover good, and blessed is he who trusts in the Lord. The verse reminds us that those who pay attention to God's word and place their trust in the Lord find blessings and goodness. Trusting in God and following his guidance can lead to a fulfilled and joyful life. As you embark on this new day, remember that placing your trust in the Lord opens the door to happiness and contentment. May you find joy in his word and blessings in your trust in him. Dear brothers and sisters of Grace Wave, may the Lord guide us on this day in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Remember to subscribe, support us with a like, and activate the notification bell so you can receive these prayers filled with love every morning. We value your input and would love to hear from you. 
Please take a moment to share in the comments what specific types of prayers or verses you'd like us to feature in our upcoming videos. Your feedback is important to us and we want to tailor our content to meet your spiritual needs. Have a blessed day and many blessings to you. And don't forget God is always present.